Hi, everybody. Oh, am I happy to be with you today. Well, how happy are you? I'm so happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show oh. it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. All right. Well, then there you go. Exactly. <laughs> That's a good way to start. I That's like awesome. it. Well, listen, how, how's everybody doing? Are they happy? You know are you what? happy? They are hanging in there. Okay. Now, there are times that, and I get this, that they're like, mm -hmm. When are we ever going to be able to do things like we want to do? Yeah. For example, um, go and spend money mm. and go to the movies. That's what Michael likes yeah, to do. But imagine. you know what? Here's They're hanging in there because okay. they Good. know Good. that soon, very soon, we will be able yeah. to do this. And what is so exciting, and they did get excited to hear this, is that Peggy Hill mm -hmm. has offered okay. to make face masks for them. Really? Yes, so that when they go out, they've got face masks. It's so interesting that you mentioned that. Because you know what I've got? Oh, have you got one? Peggy Hill... Made me some because I've got a big mouth. She had to make bigger ones for me. And I just happened to be wearing one that she made me. Let's see. Let, let it, sh please well, well, share. So, so, so it's really important if they're going to get some from Peggy because Peggy makes really good ones. We've also had another um, church member, Ann Holler. Oh, Ann. She's been nice. making masks. Nice. And both Peggy and Ann have been giving it out to people at hospitals. We have some here at the church. Oh, Now nice. Friendship Class is going to yes. get some. So if they're thinking about uh, maybe at some point when it's okay, when right. their caregivers say that it's all right, there's going to be two really important things that everybody needs to try to do as we get, go back out. Okay. All right, the first thing is, well, there's really kind of three, but two of them are related to each other. Uh-huh. Rule number one is really important. Okay. Is you have to wash your hands. Oh, yes. You know, uh, uh, yes. So, like, if you go to the bathroom every time. Right. Even if it's a short bathroom trip and it, right. you didn't think it was it. Nope, got to wash your hands. Right. Even sometimes if you, like, go outside and handle things. Yes. Come back in, wash your hands. Right. And you don't always have the stuff to wash your hands. So, there's this other stuff called hand sanitizer. Oh, that's right. Yes, and I've got I keep some in my purse. Yes, I do. And I bet you their caretakers will have some too. Of course they will. So, if you can't wash your hands, you can always use some of the hand sanitizer, wipe it all, and it dries out real quick. It, it feels kind of funny. It does. It feels like I'm in yeah. a breeze when I go like this. It's very cool. Oh, yeah. Cooling. Ooh, yeah. Oh, I didn't know. yeah. You know, it is very cooling like I'm in yeah. I'm in a breeze. Ooh. Yeah, and you should, and even when you're washing your hands or using the sand, just make sure that you get all your hands covered and yes. get all up in the cracks and maybe rub around your thumb and get all the. So that's rule number one: is your okay, hands have hands to be, be clean. clean. Sure. Sanitize but, them or wash them. And the other thing, when we're going and back it, and out, it smells good too. Yeah. You're right. That is good smell. I mean, yeah. smelling good. Yeah. So that's one thing that helps. And then the other is the face mask. Yes. And before I put it on and show you how to do it. Yes. I'm going to tell you why face masks are important. Please. So a lot of people think they're not, but they are. Yes, I agree. For one really important reason. The face masks don't keep the bad stuff away from you. What face masks do is if you have maybe a sickness mm -hmm. if guess what happens if you cough <coughs> your breath and all the stuff on the face mask all that stuff mm -hmm. it doesn't spread out okay. so other people breathe it in right so when you get one of these face masks you'll put them on like this and i love how peggy's is designed mm -hmm. they have these little clips 
where you can just sense Adjust them. it. Yeah. Oh, my. And, oh, I want one now. Oh, and, my goodness. I and want one. not only does it have that, because it has two little parts. Well, I should show you how you do it from the beginning when you first see the mask. So, yes. So you'll have it like this. The clip part should be at the top. Okay. And the loop part should be on the bottom. Okay. You take the loop part and you put that over like this. Around your neck. Cool. Yeah. yeah. And then that goes. And then you get the clip part on the top. Get your mask how you want it. Yes. And then make your adjustments. Okay, that feels pretty good. Like that. And then here's the real trick for Peggy's. Uh-huh. She has a little bendable metal thing yes. right in here. Yes. You can adjust it around your nose. Well, you know what? Look at that. That's great, Sam, because it's like, it's fitting. It yeah. fits perfect to you. Oh, my gosh. And this and is, then, yeah, see, and, and see, and like I said, it, it can kind of filter some things out. So maybe if somebody has a sickness, you won't get as many of their germs, and maybe sure. that'll help you. Sure. But the real reason that we wear face masks, and when the time comes, even when they come back to church, yes, when when we're all can do that again, yes, we're probably still going to be wearing face masks Good. for a while. Good. And the reason is, is because again, if you cough uh -huh. or you're talking, like I've got a big mouth, right, and lots of breath, right. When I'm talking, your breath and all that stuff can kind of get really far out. Yes. Even with the sick, you know, sometimes if somebody's sick, the mask kind of keeps it to where it only kind of goes out maybe this far. Right. Good. And that, Good. And they've shown in some places in the world that use the face masks that they were able to cut down on the numbers of people that got sick by a whole lot by using face masks. You know what? And I... Thank you for sharing that, yeah. in that I recently read an article, mm -hmm. and I don't know if I shared with the friendship class, mm -hmm. the uh, my cousin. Now, you all have recalled me going to visit my Aunt Ellen up in Bethesda, Maryland. Okay. Well, her daughter, the firstborn eldest that was named for our precious grandmother, Jane worked at Walter Reed mm. Army Institute of Research mm. in Bethesda. Mm -hmm. and she lives in Hyattsville. Mm. She told me yeah. about Dr. Fauci mm. and Dr. Burks because mm. she worked with them. Wow, that's cool. Isn't that cool? That is cool. So recently, they now have done further scientific mm -hmm. studies yeah. confirming yeah. that what you just said about the face mask it works is true and and that's why I, you know i saw that guy dr fauci on the news yes and you know he's one of the and if you don't know who he is he's one of these uh he's a good scientist person right. who's really trying to help us all come to a solution right to this and uh and, and when he was on television guess what he was wearing a face mask. He was wearing a face mask. So, the two keys when it's time to kind of go back out a little bit. Mm -hmm. Number one is wash those hands. Mm -hmm. Or if you can't wash them, hand sanitizer and get right. all the cracks. Right, right. And then number two is when you go out, right. wear your face mask. Yes, and I also saw that, and that goes with what our lesson is today hmm. is the face mask are also not just about protecting ourselves yeah. but protecting others yes. and someone said that wearing a face mask is showing a sign of compassion yeah loving your neighbor like you love yourself showing compassion to others yeah that's good. So, in some ways, you can say when you're wearing a face mask, you're telling everybody you meet, I love you. That's right. That there is we go. It, that's exactly right. I love you. Absolutely. I, I love you. Yeah. There you go. There we go. That's and that's good. what the face mask means. That's a good lesson. All yes, right. Yes, it is. Well, and it kind of got in it. Our story today is about... 
Compassion. That's good. Yes. That's good. Well, how is everybody doing? We should say hi to everybody. Let's do it. Okay. Let's All do right. it. I okay. love it when we do that. Okay. okay. So here is hi to Flora May. Flora May. Hey, 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 hey. Patty. Patty, Patty, Patty. Patty, who is also my teacher assistant. Yes. She does a good job. She does a great job in making sure of our lessons. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then there's Jan. Jan. Yep. Jan. Our music director. Yes. She knows, knows all the songs. Exactly. And can sing as well as Dot. Yeah. Then there's Michael. Mike. What's up, Mike? Absolutely, Michael. Scott. Scott. What's yep. up, man? Exactly. Scott. And Chris. Chris. Yeah, we gotta Chris. say well, and Chris, we gotta say what friend, friend, and yeah. I, I or we, yeah. we love, love you. you. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then there's Porter, Porter, yes. and Harry, and Harry, yeah, and Ricky, Ricky, hey. that's right, and then there's Joe Lynn, Joe Lynn, hey Miss Joe Lynn, with hey. Don, absolutely, yeah. Violet. Yes. And her roommate, Sandy. Sandy and Violet. That's so right. we say, say you're friend. our friends. Happy. And today we're taping this on Thursday, which is Violet's happy, happy. birthday. No, uh, so how do you do birthday? You go birthday. Chris birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah. All right, so exactly. happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday, and guess what I'm going to deliver to her house after this? What? Dot always makes sure that they have a cake mm -hmm. and a card with money. Oh! So, yeah, money. so I'm going to be delivering that oh, Violet's gonna birth, be rich. happy birthday cake to Violet. Oh, that's awesome. Exactly. That's awesome. Well, and you mentioned Miss Dot. Yes. So we should say, hey, Miss Dodd. Absolutely. Hey. And above us, always watching out for us. Of course, God's always watching Absolutely. out for us. Absolutely. But God has given us special little angels in our lives. That's right. All our caretakers. All our caretakers. Thank caretakers. you. Thank you. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, yeah. yeah. So it's good to see everybody. And, and everybody's doing okay. Yes, they are. And let me tell you, mm. Scott called me okay. after last week's okay. lesson. All right. And I said, Scott, do you whistle like Sam? With, mm. And he whistled and he said, yeah. yeah. I said, unlike Debbie going, No, I can't do it. I still can't do that. I try. I can't do that. Yeah, you can do it. Oh, man. <laughs> Was well, that not cool? That's fun. That is a lot of fun. So there you go. Yeah. They, I love that. I tell you, and seeing your precious Sammy oh. walking across the bridge to yeah. the Andy Griffith and look, song. I, I loved it. And we still need prayers because he is still yet to catch his own fish. Sure, sure. He's sure. still learning how to do it. So I'm serious, everybody. You have got to pray to help Sammy out. Be like, Lord. You know, Sammy's trying. He's yeah. trying to learn his best. Right. Just be with him and help him out a little bit. Exactly. Okay. But you know what? Seeing Sammy mm. and just the grins on his face mm. yeah. with um, the smiles and the grin is how yeah. I should say it. But anyway, of uh, being yeah. out like, you know, like Porter loves to fish. There's something so calming about hearing the water yeah. flow. Well, he's getting ready to take another step, so I went ahead and bought him waders. Yes. And so, if you don't know what that is, it's kind of like a, a rubber suit yeah, okay, that you sure. wear up like this with a little shoulder, and so you can walk in the water. Nice. And I'm gonna be, I'm gonna teach him how to use the fly rod a little bit. Cool. And we're gonna just get out and see if we can and get get one for him. So. Great. Yeah. Great, great, great. It'll be fun. Okay. Yeah, so everybody's doing good. Yes, they are. And, um, you know, so I'm, I'm really happy about that. And uh, caretakers are okay? They are. They okay. really, really are. And um, have so appreciated um, watching the videos, too, mm -hmm. with um, Good. all our special friends. And... Um, there you Excellent. Go. Well, again, thank you for everything you do for our special friends. Oh my gosh! So. Absolutely. 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 Yeah. So, so we have a song today. Yes, and the third, first one I thought we would do okay. is "God is So Good." All right. Let's we look don't at sing it. this one Let's as very often, but you know what? I thought that would be good, especially. Yeah. 
lesson's going to be about today. Okay, all right. And well, we can do like maybe verses one, two, and four or something. I like it. All right, we can do that. I, All right. I know this song. Do you? Yeah. Okay, so I'm counting on you. All right, you want me to start? Yeah, I did. Okay. Right. And you know what? I think I did say that. You're happy and you know it. In tune. I think I did. Hey, there we go. I know. It's your your singing there. is rubbing off on me. There we I go. Like it. Well, and well, and 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 Jan, if you're there, and I know you are, you can kind of sing it, and I'm sure it'll sound much better when you're singing it. But we'll try. She this. is so good. So, God is so good. God is so good. God is so good. He's so good to me. He cares for me. He cares for me. He cares for me. He's so good to me. He loves me so. He loves me so. He loves me so. He's so good to me. And I know an extra verse to this one. I may have sang it before, but we can do it. He answers prayers. He answers prayer. He answers prayer. He's so good to me. I like that song. I do God too. is good. He really, really Absolutely. is. Absolutely. Yeah, and Jesus was really good to people too, right? He really, really was. And that's kind of our story for that's today. That's our story today. But we cannot get to our story until we have our field trip. You know what? What? We have gone at this place where the field trip is have going been. to be. Have yes. Been. Okay. And we did it, I'm wanting to think. I think I'm right. You all make sure that I am. I think we did it one time on a Mother's Day Sunday. Really? Yes. Good. And we went outside and we it was it was a great time. And okay. we sat outside for a little bit right. at this location and did our Sunday school lesson right. out there. Well, we're going to go on our secret field trip. I love it. And we're going to get our story, and we're going to have some fun out there. So everybody prepare yourself. I like it. If you need a snack or you need to go to the bathroom, now's the time to do it. Well, and actually, uh -huh. I do want them uh -huh. to have a snack. Yeah. You'll see. You'll see. Okay, so they and should get a snack it. ready. And yes, if they're they doing should. a snack, they should do something like wash their hands right. before they eat. Exactly. Yeah, that'd be good. So get ready. Go wash your hands. Get your snack. Get ready. We're getting ready to go on our field trip. Come follow me. All right, here we go. Field trip time. We're making our way through the halls. We're racing, we're racing, we're racing. No pit stops except to say hi, Miss hey, Betsy. Hey, How you I'm doing? Hey, I'm my hands, guys, because I'm happy. All I'm right. <laughs> we're making our way. We're zooming on through. Wait, we got somebody else here. Nope, Miss Scotty, I think she might be out to lunch. So here we go. We're winding our way, winding our way. Whoa, this one is a curvy road to this field trip. All right, we're making our way down the halls. I wonder where we could be going. Well, we won't go to the courtyard. We've already been there. But it is very pretty out it's there, gorgeous. isn't it? It's gorgeous. Yes. I love that courtyard. Oh, so okay. not the courtyard. We're not going fishing again. No, we're, we're not. not going to the courtyard. And we're not. We're not going where? We're not going to go to the chapel. We're not going to the chapel. Where could we be going? Should we, we'll go. We can go this way, maybe. Yeah, let's go this we'll way. We'll go on yeah, through yeah. this way, see what special oh. place we're going. There's some more people we're saying hello to. Say hello to the friendship class. Hey, guys. Say hello. Hey guys. All right, here we go. We're zooming down the corridor on our field and trip. 
Whoa, it's a dark one down here. That's right. And oh, <gasps> oh I bet you everybody just misses this room, don't they? Let's they see if we do. can get the light on yes, here. Yes, we can. It's right over here. Oh, I remember this room. Does everybody remember this room? Yes. Every, we love this room, don't we? we? Yes, we do. We come in here, we sit around, and here are the tables we've got. Miss Debbie that's right. sits here. Flora, Flora May, May. Patty. Patty. Jan. Jan Michael, Michael. Scott. Scott Chris, Chris. Porter. Miss Jo Lynn. Lynn. Sometimes I sit here. That's right. And, and Violet. Violet. And Violet right there. Right. Everybody's got and their there's seat. there's a seat right there. Right there. Yeah. There's Scott. Chris. That's where Dot used to sit. Oh, right my. Right there. Yeah. 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 Well, someday when it's safe to come back, we'll, we'll be back be. in the room when the time is right. That's exactly right. But this is not our field trip. No, nope, we're not there yet. We're okay. still going on the field trip. That's right. Let's see. Still making our way down a dark corridor towards the light. Yep. All right. And this is the door. That when we brought in food, uh -huh. Patty will open this door okay. for us to go out. All right. We go through I this mean, door. for me to come in and bring in the food. Okay. Yep. So we're heading out this door into the bright sunlight. Yes, we are. Where could we be going out here? I think they'll remember. We've been up through here. Okay. Yes, we have. It is very warm out here and very sunny. Yeah, and I didn't bring my sunglasses, but that's okay. This makes me feel like a day I definitely would love to go fishing. I but we're not going fishing. No, we're not. Here we go. We're going somewhere. Oh, it's so pretty out here. Isn't it beautiful? Very nice. And we have come here. I see and seats. Uh huh. We have sat here uh -huh. for our Sunday school lessons. You know what? Well, how about how about you sit this way and face this way, and I'll like sit it. here. Because remember, we also need to keep a little distance these days, right? You know what? We should absolutely. This is perfect, perfect uh, pasture. Oh, stand. and look, it was perfect just with the camera here too. Yes, it is. That's great. So. So what are we going to do out here, Miss? You Ms? know what? Yeah. Guess what our lesson is. What? And I'm going to have you read it. Okay. But. Can you all guess what it could be? What is our lesson? Something about compassion. Compassion. Jesus. Jesus. And notice you're thinking, <gasps> why does Debbie have... Here's my, where I pack mm -hmm. my lunch. So you have your lunch bag. Yes, I do. And this is what, notice my initials. Yeah. Oh, let's, let's zoom in on that. See my initials, my monogram, mm -hmm. DJW, mm -hmm. Deborah Jean Whitaker, mm -hmm. named for my mother. All right. Jean. <laughs> so there you go in that. wonder why I would have brought my lunch bag. Why? Do you have something in there? I have some food in here. You have food in there? I have food in here. Wonder what it could be. And maybe they have their snacks there, right? Okay, so here we go. And that, what is the lesson about? Jesus feeds the one person? No, I think Jesus feeds Two more people. than one. No, more than that. Three, four, five. Lots more. Five. More. Five thousand people five thousand i bet you if you put five thousand people you see all this field out here i bet we could have five thousand people I, but i bet you it would fill it would fill the whole thing up yes it would oh my goodness five thousand people five thousand people wow so here we go all right so you want me to read that i want you to read and you're gonna and what story. are you gonna do are you gonna do something over there i am what are you going to do? You want me to show the food? Sure. Okay, well, let me give well, you... Well, maybe I'm kind of hungry, too. That's right. Okay, we'll see. So, All right. If I feed... Okay. Now, 
So am I allowed to read this and kind of munch at the same time? Why not, Pastor okay. Sam? Okay, all right, we'll Why see how that but goes. Here's what we're going to do. All right. Because we're going to eat. Yeah. I will. Oh, that's a good idea. We got, Remember, we got to keep our hands clean. That's right. There we go. All right, I'll use a little bit of this myself. Just a little drop will do you. Uh, just a little drop. And guess oh, what? Oh, and see? See what I'm doing? Yep. Oh, all in there. Exactly. Getting it really good. So here we go. So what are we having? What? Okay. Patty. Jan. Flora May. Violet. Scott. Michael. Chris. Porter. Jolene. What did Jesus feed? And who was the one that brought their lunch? Mm. I wonder if he had it in a monogram bag. I sort of kind of doubt it. But mm. he brought his lunch and it was two fishes. Oh, wow. And how many of those bags of fish do you have? I have one for you. Okay. And one for me so he, jesus had two fish for the, that the little fish. boy brought that's right so we got two bags of, two fish. Bags of fish okay all right okay, there you thank go thank you i've got that and then five loaves okay of bread which there are now there's six in there but we can take six. one away and make we'll it take five one of five okay so then here is for you oh i've got a loaf of bread look a at that i got my loaf of bread and i've got One for me. There we go. So we've got fish. We got fish, and we've got loaves. That's right. Now, and they know that we have in our friendship class mm -hmm. when we do snacks, mm -hmm. we've done peanut butter uh -huh. crackers. Okay. And we've done. Gold wow, fish. that's good. Yes, we have. So I'm going to start reading it, and we can kind of eat, and maybe I can munch sometimes I'm, too. I, you know what? Okay. Listen, I'm you're, already are you you're up. already hungry? Okay, I am. I'm going to open up. I'm going to start eating my fish. So yes, here's I am. so you watch Miss Deborah while she's eating, and I'm going to read the story. Jesus feeds five thousand. Jesus was trying to get some alone time, but everywhere he went, large crowds of people followed him. He and his disciples got on a boat to get away from the crowds for a little while, but. When the boat docked, he found that the people had rushed across the land and they were waiting for him over there on the other side. It's crazy. I love this because you know what? Yeah. People were following Jesus. That's true. Everywhere That's true. he went. Yeah. People wanted to know about him. Mm -hmm. And see, and Jesus hear what did, he had to say. Yeah, and Jesus didn't just keep running away. It says here that Jesus was filled with love for the people. So, because he loved them so much, he healed the sick that they had brought to him, and he taught them about God. The afternoon passed on quickly, and when evening came, the disciples came to Jesus. I bet you their tummies were kind of like, ooh, because it's been a long day. Mm-hmm. And they said, you know what, Jesus, you got to send these people away so they can go into the village and get some food. Food. Because I'm hungry. That's right. But Jesus had another idea. He said, nope, you get food for them. Can you imagine if Jesus said, get food for 5,000 people? No, I cannot. If he told me to go get food, I would be thinking, where would I be getting, where? Where do I get food? Yeah, if you had enough like people right to fill here. that whole thing up, would, where would where, you get all the food? Where, where are we to get food? I don't know. That's what the disciples said. It's not possible, Jesus. We don't have enough money to buy food for all these people. Well, Jesus said, what food do you got on you? Like us, what food do we got on us? We got a little bag of goldfish. That's right. Here's my lunch. My and lunch. we got our loaves of bread That's here. That's right. Well, they said there's just a young boy in the crowd and he has he has his lunch. Five loaves of bread and two fish. And you know what? The little boy, I bet you he was hungry 
But he said, you know what, Jesus? I'll give it to you. I'll give you what I got. Fish. But it isn't enough to feed all the people. But I'll give you what I got. Fish. So Jesus said, get that little kid's lunch for me. And then have all the people sit down in groups of 50. And Jesus took the loaves and fish. And he lifted them up to heaven. And asked God to bless it. Because that's why we, we do. We, we pray before a meal, right? right? Yeah, you know what we do? You know what? Hmm. Why don't we say a blessing? A blessing. Okay. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to unwrap my loaves here. I'm unwrapping the loaves, getting them ready. And let's say a prayer. Let's, let's say a, yeah, a blessing. What do you say when you pray before you eat? Well, when I was, God is so good. Thank well, let's, you. And we Wait. sang that, didn't we? Yeah, we did. But what is it? Thank you for the many blessings that mm. you give us. Yeah. God is good. God is great. Yeah. Thank him for... Hmm. How does that blessing go? God is good. God is great. Thank you for... The food the on our plate. On our plate. <laughs> there we go. We just made one up. That's right. So God, let's say it. God, God is, is good. good. God, God is, is great. great. Thank, Thank you, you Lord, Lord, for the food, food on, on my plate. plate. All right. And then we're going to eat it up. Um, mm. That's right. Oh, that's good. He lifted it up to heaven. He gave his blessing. And guess what happened? He started breaking the fish up like us. We're breaking the loaves up and the fish and out and all that kind of stuff. And guess what? He passed it out to the people. It fed those just five loaves and two fish fed 5,000 people. The and food, not only, Yeah, the food just kept coming. And not only did he feed the 5,000 people, there were 12 baskets full of food left when it was all done. And you know what, Pastor Sam? You know one of the ministries that we have here hmm. at First Presbyterian Church is what? we volunteer of sharing Christ, mm -hmm. where we feed people mm. who, are, who are hungry in Bristol. And do you know who has helped with the sharing of Christ in who? our fellowship class? Who? Scott Sams, mm -hmm. Michael Bryant, and Chris Winters. They actually went and they did that? They actually have went. They mm. actually have gone. Mm -hmm. Not they have went. They actually have gone to volunteer and have helped serve the people in our community who are hungry. That is so and good. sharing Christ. That's so good. Isn't that the best? Mm. And I remember one time, mm -hmm. we thought we were running out of food. We were thinking, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. But you know what? Mm. Just like... The feeding of the 5,000 and the food kept coming and coming and coming. That's what happened that time when we were with Sharing Christ with Scott and Michael and Chris. And there was enough food. There was enough food. Wow. Food That's great. Just like the story. Yeah. You know, this is really yummy. Mm. Good. Yeah, I know. And Just... I'm loving that. I don't ordinarily always get goldfish. No, you know this. Mm -hmm. Oh, my goodness. But here are the fish. Yeah. And Pastor Sam ate the loaves of bread. We've had our loaves and our fish. Mm -hmm. And it's really good. And you know, that's the way God works sometimes. God doesn't give us a bunch of stuff we don't need. Because sometimes when we pray, we just like want, I don't know, all kinds of stuff we really don't need. Just because we thought it, we think it might be fun or we might like it. You know, maybe somebody there that day would have said, I really would love to have a steak. He didn't give them a steak, but he gave them what they needed. Right. And he I think showed that, yeah. them compassion because they were hungry. And yeah. maybe that's what I needed, was I needed a pack of crackers and you needed some goldfish. Yes. And yes. God can use anything that we have, even if it's small, to do really amazing things. I think so. I agree. Because Jesus loves us that much. He does. And he's always there providing what we need when we need it. Mm. And 
and the friendship class will always tell you I'll say thank you dear heavenly dear heaven above our Lord in heaven for all the many blessings wow. that you give to me each and every day that's amazing God is good. That's what yes, we sing. That's God right. is good. Exactly. All right. Well, let's get back in. We got to finish up our field trip and finish up our today. Uh, finish up today's lesson. Okay. Uh, we'll do it. And All right. Do, and we'll sing when we go in there. Okay. Or do you want me to sing here? I don't know. Do you want to sing here? You know, what is our song? Do. It's one that we have never sung, but I thought what we were sing what we were doing mm -hmm. is we were eating. And here's a song that they may remember. Okay. And it's Let Us Break Bread Together. Okay. Do you know that song? Yeah, yeah, but you start us off. Okay. Let us break, break bread, bread together, together on our knees, knees, on our knees. Let, Let us break bread together, together on our knees, on our knees. When, when I fall on my knees with my face to the rising sun, O Lord, have mercy on me, on me. That's good. I like that. that. You know, we don't have to go back in to finish. Why don't we finish out here? Because we always just finish with prayer, don't we? We do. We do. Well, let's do that right now. Let's all just bow our heads, close our eyes. And I'm going to close this out with a word of prayer. And Miss Deborah, and I'll get a shot on you as I pray, okay? okay? Let's all pray. Lord, I want to thank you for all the members of our friendship class. Lord, I know it's been hard these many weeks to just stay home and think about all the things we'd like to do and we can't do right now. But Lord, just continue to give them courage and patience. Lord, just help them continue to be a blessing. Be with their caretakers, and we give you thanks for them. We pray for Miss Dot and Miss Diana. Bless them. Help her be well. We pray for Miss Lynn and Mr. Don. Bless them and keep them. We pray for Miss Deborah. Just ask that you would continue to bless her. We pray for our church and our community that you would keep us safe and healthy so that in the end, Lord, we might just glorify you in all these things and just give you the praise all our days. Because we know that Jesus loves us. We pray this in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And all God's children said, said Amen. Amen. Bye. Bye. See ya. Bye. You got it.